let's continue with exercise 6b question 2 in question 2 we have triangle abc then we have ad aligned from angle a so we need to check whether this ad is the bisector of angle a or not provided number 2 ab they give us 8 cm ac 24 cm bc 24 cm and bd equals 6 cm uh, since they want to prove it is a uh, angle bisector so we'll try to take the ratio of the side which contained angle as well as the ratio of the side where the bisector meet okay so based on that we can take this one a b by a c a b we know 8 a c we know 24 here we can divide 8 1 are 8, 8 3 za. Then we can also take BD by DC. BD we know 6. DC we don't know, but instead we know BC. So if we look from the figure, BC we have 24 cm, but BC we can break it as BD plus DC. But here we already have BD equal 6 cm. So this is plus. Take that side become minus. So we are left with 18 cm. So here 6 into 1, 6 into 3. Now if we compare both the ratio are same. So if both the ratio are same, that mean we can conclude that you can we compare from the diagram. We have the ratio of the side contain angle A and the ratio which cut by the angle bisector. So since they are equal, we can say that AD is a bisector of angle A. Number three also goes the same way. We have to show whether AD is a bisector or not. So what to do? We have to check the ratio as well. The ratio of the containing side and the ratio of the opposite side. Since we suspect AD to be a bisector, let us take the ratio of the containing side. That is AB by AC. AB we know it's 5. AC we know 12. We cannot cancel. Let it be like that. Then next the ratio of the opposite side. That is BD by DC. BD we know it is 1.6. DC we don't know but we know BC. So the same way BC we have it 9 cm. If you look at the figure BC we can break it as BD in plus DC. Then we have BD equal 1.6. We can find out easily DC. We want DC. This is plus. Take the side become minus. 9 has no decimal. So we can produce it. 1.6. 10 borrow from here. Become 4. 8 or the give you a 1, 9 or the give you a 1 become 8, 8 minus 1, 7. So that means DC, <coughs> we get it now equal to 7.4 cm. Then let us see the ratio. We have here DC equal 7.4, so let's replace it. Since we have decimal up and down, let us adjust with 0. If you have decimal up, you can put zero down. If you have decimal down, you can put zero up. So here zero, zero, we can cancel. Then here 1674, both even number. Two into eight, two into three, two into seven. So here we have five by 12. Here we have eight by 37, which mean that the ratio are not equal. So if the ratio are not equal, we can say that AD is a is not a bisector of angle A. AB by AC. 
they are not equal because we see here we get 8 by 37 there we get 5 by 12 <coughs> so when the ratio are not equal we can say that ad is not a bisector so similarly you can try yourself question number four